you know, when you're going for a smash in badminton or if you're playing golf and you have to drive long, pitching in a baseball game, javelin throw, in tennis, especially with the forehand, backhand, uh, change in direction and turns in basketball. You can see this one is a great example. Pretty impressive, actually. Uh, batting again in baseball, in cricket, for bowlers and batsmen, and change in direction in football, soccer. Cristiano Ronaldo is a great example of that. Now, sports is not a one-directional activity. You move in multiple directions constantly. It involves change in direction, uh, slowing down and then accelerating, throwing something, kicking something, etc. It is very important to train rotation to be a well-rounded athlete. Now, before I show you a few examples of exercises, let's talk about the core and the sling. Very brief explanation, core is not just, not just your six-pack ab. It includes your obliques, hips, lower back, pelvis, as well as the diaphragm. So you need to train the entire core and not just do crunches to get that six-pack ab. That's a byproduct of training the core. Now remember, you don't always work just one muscle at a time. A lot of other muscles do a lot of work in synergy to make sure that you perform the best on the field or whatever you do. Take throwing for instance. Uh, energy is generated in one region of the body, which is the leg, uh, transferred through the hips and the pelvis and then released through the upper body uh, to deliver a pitch or when you, if you're bowling in cricket or smashing with badminton uh, and a lot of force is produced in that. So this transfer of force is through slings, different chains in your body of muscles so one muscle then gets that force, uh, passes on, transfer, 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 and then you end up doing the act. There you have it guys, a very short and concise explanation of uh, rotation and why it's important. Of course, there are way too many exercises that you can incorporate in your training schedule and your program. These are just a few examples of, of footage of which I had. You could do landmine, you could do resistance bands, you can do it with dumbbells as well. Uh, lots to do. You can do top rotation, you can do bottom rotation, you can do anti-rotation, uh, it's endless obviously. If you do want more exercises that are catered to rotational piece, always write it in the comments and we can make a specific video for it as well. I hope you found this video helpful and like it. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't. I know we are here and there when it comes to uploading on YouTube. We moved all our uh, operations into the UAE from Dubai. Maybe I might even make a video off of it comparing how it's like training in Canada, how it's like training in the UAE. Uh, but thank you for the support. And as always, I'll see you next time.